Two protons approach each other. The protons have been accelerated to very high energy, practically the speed of light. Let's zoom in on one of the protons. It is composed of three quarks, two up quarks and one down quark, moving around very close to each other. The quarks are kept together by a number of gluons interacting with the quarks and also with the other gluons. The gluons give rise to the gluon field that keeps the constituents of the proton together. When the two colliding protons get very close and overlap, an energetic gluon from each of the protons is emitted from one of the quarks. The two high-energy gluons merge in a dramatic event. In the very energetic gluon fusion, several things can happen. Sometimes, the fusion of the two gluons results in the production of a Higgs particle. The Higgs particle can decay in many ways among others, into two photons. The advantage with this decay is that it is relatively easy to observe the two high-energy photons in the Atlas detector. The drawback is that this is a very unusual decay of the Higgs particle. If the Higgs particle exists, it will most certainly be detected in the Atlas detector in the high-energy proton collisions at the CERN-LHC collider.